Okay, let me start this video off by saying, from the title you can clearly see, I've been listening to Nicki Minaj's um, new song, um, album called Roman Reloaded, Pink Friday, whatever, whatever she wanted to call this shit. And I made it up to number 11. I really can't bear to listen to it anymore. I don't know. I just can't listen to it because it's not like she's becoming too much for me. Like the alter egos and all of that. Okay, do what you must. But it's becoming a lot. Like it's not even really music to me anymore. It's becoming more theatrical than anything. It's like I'm watching a play when I'm listening to this song. I understand music is supposed to give you visual, it's supposed to do like something for you, but this is not doing what I want. This is giving me opera house that I don't want to listen to. And it's whack, <laughs> to be completely honest, it's whack. And I have to say her last album, well her first album, Pink Friday, regular with no Roman involvement, was... It was good. The album was good. All the tracks. Like, I could listen to that album straight with no problem. This reloaded bullshit with Moscow and all of the top. This is just so much for my life. I can't take it. It's it's too much. It's too much. Nikki, relax. I wasn't going to make a video about it because it's not really that serious. But I was just listening to it and, like... I'm listening to some of the songs and like the the features, I can't even tell that they're her song. To be completely honest, like a lot of the features I can't tell are even her song. One's called Champion, the other one is Right By My Side, and the other one is Sex In The Lounge. I can't even tell those are her songs. I hardly hear her on those songs. Like, they, I was listening to it and I'm doing something else, so it's like... Wait, did the album change? Is my iTunes on shuffle? Like, what's going on? Click on it, and it's still on the CD, and it's still whack as fuck. Just because you have a couple of hit-making people, you got Chris Brown and Nas and Drake, okay. But this album still fucking sucks. Like, step it up. No, it's just not good. I'm gonna try to feel better about it after I listen to these last eight songs and then these three bonus ones. But it's just like, are you serious? This is doing too much for me. And the only reason I even downloaded the album was because I was in a club last night. That's why I look like this, dry, tired, and sound crazy. I was in a club and they were playing a bunch of her new songs. Mind you, this album just came out on Tuesday. Nobody even got a chance to learn the damn songs and they were playing them in the club. So, you know my ass was sitting down like, I don't know this shit. But, I listened to it and I'm glad that I didn't know it because it's horrible. But, enough of that. Nikki, I'm disappointed. I expected you to come back with some, like, some bangers. There's, don't get me wrong, there are maybe two or three songs on here that are hot, like hot shit and I'm not talking about one that's already been released like stupid ho and none of that but I am they some of them are real hot she dope punch lines and all of that but um this shit is not up to the standard that people are holding it up to and it's become so obvious that most of the songs are geared towards her going to little kim that it's becoming ridiculous i understand they don't like each other but i don't give a fuck like just make some banging ass music i don't want to hear about little kim in every Nicki minaj song and i don't want to hear about Nicki minaj in every little kim song you have beef keep that to your damn self keep that at home because i don't want to hear it oh did you hear Nicki's punch about little kim da -da -da. hang it up y'all are too damn old too grown to be writing music about each other. Like, right now y'all both sucking. So, step it up.
shit is whack. But I am gonna make another video when I look better, sound better, and feel better because this song, this this album just made me, my whole mood just went like, seriously? I was listening to this thinking I'm about to get hype in the house. Like, maybe this will make me want to get up and clean my house. This didn't do nothing but make me want to get in my bed and go to sleep. I felt like I was being punked. I felt like iTunes tricked me when I bought this. I felt like it was a joke. Like, this is a Nicki Minaj spoof album. You've been played. We just took your $10. Like, but it wasn't. It was the real deal, and it was horrible. And... I can't. I just can't. I'm done. This video is over. I have nothing else to say about this. If Nicki Minaj or any of her people watch this video, please, do better. That's all I'm just gonna say. Do fucking better.